Top 10 tallest buildings in the world. Welcome to Displore and thanks for watching. In today's video, we shall be taking you around the world and shining the light on top 10 tallest buildings in the world. Since the beginning of history, humans have tried to reach the skies. Living in the big houses was associated with being at the top of the social hierarchy. Even considering ancient world of the Egyptian pharaohs, they thought the higher, the better. If you look up before at one of those iconic landmark tower structures, you understand how amazing they can be. The craze for tall towers started from Petronas Towers Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia during the later 90s and continues to this day. These spectacular and high structures yet are proof of how far the technique of civil engineering have gone. If you are new here, welcome, be sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of our videos. Year in, year out, we want to know which buildings are the tallest in the world and for this we turn to the Council on Tall Buildings and urban habitats for the latest data on official building heights and construction progress. Some buildings are not included in this video because they are not yet totally completed. From their last rankings, here are the top 10 tallest buildings in the world. Number 10. China Zun, China. Height 528 meters, 108 floors. CITIC Tower is a super tall skyscraper in the central business district of Beijing, popularly known as China Zun. The 109th story 528 meters building is the tallest in the city, surpassing that of the China World Trade Center Tower, the third by 190 meters. On August 18, 2016, CITIC Tower surpassed China World Trade Center Tower, the third in height, becoming Beijing's tallest building and the ninth tallest in the world. The nickname China Zun comes from the Zun, an ancient Chinese wine vessel which inspired the building design. According to the developers, the CITIC Group, Farrell's produced the tower's land bead concept design, with Korn, Pedersen, Forks assuming the project and completing a 14-month long concept design process after the client had won the bead. China Zone Tower is a mixed-use building, featuring 60 floors of office space, 20 floors of luxury apartments and 20 floors of hotel with 300 rooms. There is a rooftop garden on the top floor at 524 meters high. Number 9. Tianjin City Air Finance Center Height 530 meters, 98 floors Located in the outer district of the Tianjin Economic Technological Development Area, Tianjin City Finance Center is a super tall skyscraper in Tianjin, China. Construction started in 2013 and was completed in 2019. The tower is the second tallest building in Tianjin after Golden Finance 117, ninth tallest completed building in the world, and the tallest building in the world with less than 100 floors. The crystalline-like curtain wall stretches from the suspended glass canopies at each of the lobbies to the dematerialized mega column looped crown and present a bold expression of a comprehensive integrated design on the Tianjin skyline. Number 8. Guangzhou CTF Finance Center, China. Height 530 meters, 111 floors. The Guangzhou Chao Tai Fuk Finance Center, also called East Tower, is a 530 meter tall mixed use skyscraper in Guangzhou, Guangdong, which was completed in October 2016. The Guangzhou City Finance Center has a total of 111 above ground and 5 below ground floors and houses a shopping mall, offices, apartments and a hotel. The skyscraper has a gross floor area of 507,681.0 meters square, of which a little over 20% is not part of the skyscraper itself but of the podium connected to it. In that neighborhood, the skyscraper is located east of the central axis with an underground mall and connections to public transportation underneath it. The Guangzhou CTF Center is part of the Guangzhou Twin Towers and the other tower of the pair of the Guangzhou International Finance Center is located on the other side of the axis and is also known under the name West Tower. The Guangzhou CTF Center is therefore known as the East Tower as well. Both towers have a similar height, size and function and are situated close to the 604 meter tall Canton Tower. The Guangzhou CTF Finance Center is owned by Chao Tai Fook Enterprises and houses the world's fastest elevators, which can reach speeds up to 21 meters per second. Number 7. One World Trade Center, USA. Height 541.3 meters, 104 floors. One World Trade Center, also known as the 1WTC or Freedom Tower, is the main building of the rebuilt World Trade Center complex in Lower Manhattan. New York City. 1WTC is the tallest building in the United States, the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere and the seventh tallest building in the world. 
The super tall structure has the same name as the North Tower of the Regional World Trade Center, which was destroyed in the terrorist attacks of September 11, 2001. The new skyscraper stands on the northwest corner of the 6.5 hectares World Trade Center site, on the site of the original 6 World Trade Center. The building is bounded by West Street to the west, Vesey Street to the north, Fulton Street to the south, and Washington Street to the east. The building's architect is David Shields, whose firm Skidmore, Owings and Merrill SOM, also designed the Burj Khalifa and the Willis Tower. The construction of the foundation for the new building began on April 27, 2006, and became the tallest structure in New York City on April 30, 2012. When it surpassed the height of the Empire State Building and was opened on November 3, 2014. Number 6 Lotte World Tower, South Korea. Height 554.5 meters, 123 floors. Lotte World Tower is a 123 floor, 557.5 meter super tall skyscraper located in Seoul, South Korea. It opened to the public on April 11, 2017, and is currently the tallest building in South Korea and the sixth tallest in the world. Lotte World Tower is a multi-facility super tall skyscraper located in Seoul, South Korea and was completed in construction in 2016. There's even more to the building as six of its 123 floors are on the ground which you can't see at first. Lotte World Tower includes retail stores, offices, apartments, a luxury seven-star hotel and an observation deck that took 13 years to schedule before placing it in operation. For visitors who travel in to enjoy the view, there are also restaurants, cafes and photo areas. The tower is built in a unique architectural design to resist earthquakes on the richer scale of up to 9 magnitudes. Number 5. Golding Finance 117, China. Height 596 meters, 128 floors. Golding Finance 117, also known as China 117 Tower, is a skyscraper under construction in Tianjin, China. The tower is expected to be 597 meters with 117 stories. Construction began in 2008 and the building was scheduled to be completed in 2014, becoming the second tallest building in China, surpassing the Shanghai World Finance Center. Construction was suspended in January 2010 but resumed in 2011 with a completion estimated in 2020. The building was stopped out on September 8, 2015 but is still under current construction. Golden Finance 117 is built to resemble a walking stick, hence its other name, walking stick. The top was supposed to be a fin-like shape. Many years later, the fin-like shape was replaced by a diamond which was made to the tallest flat-roofed building. If completed on schedule in 2020, Golden Finance 117 will be the fifth tallest building in the world. Number 4. Ping An International Finance Center, China. Height 599 meters, 115 floors. The Ping An International Finance Center is 599 meters high in Shenzhen, China, and completed in 2017 by its main contractor CSCEC. There is a conference center or hotel and several high and retail areas at the Ping An International Finance Center. It also has its namesake's headquarters of Ping An Insurance. There is a total of 33 fast double decker elevators to move around its 115 floors. American architectural firm Korn Pedersen Fox Associates provided architectural design and Thornton Tomasetti handled structural design. Originally, the building design includes an antenna but designers eventually called this plan off because of concerns about flight interference. This building has one of the world's two highest observation platforms, 562 meters high, for those who enjoy observing from the heights. Number 3. Abraj Albait Clock Tower, Saudi Arabia. Height 601 meters, 120 floors. At the heart of the holiest Islamic city, Maka Royal Clock Tower brings an air of modernization to the bustling historic center of Mecca. The tower was developed as a component of the King Abdulaziz Endowment Project and provides comfortable accommodations for devout Muslims that make the journey to the city every year during the Hajj period. It is conveniently located adjacent to the Grand Mosque which can accommodate up to 2 million worshippers over the course of the event. You might also know that this building is Mecca's Abraj Abayt or Jeddah Tower which is located in Saudi Arabia. This building has plenty of amenities like a meeting center, an Islamic museum, two prayer halls, a shopping mall, a lunar observation center and a living place for 10,000 people. 
Also, its clock has the biggest clock face in the world. The Saudi Bin Laden Group, which is the largest construction firm in Saudi Arabia, constructed the Abraj al Bayt, giving it the face it has in the world of skyscrapers. Number 2. Shanghai Tower, China. Height 632 meters, 128 floors. The Shanghai Tower, which stands at 632 meters, is the second highest building in the world and has elevators recognized as the world's second fastest moving elevators. Particularly acknowledged for the building's twist, it gives the tower a funky and interesting look. Inside are offices, a restaurant, shops, cafes, and parks, and there are also observation decks. As windows that are created with double glass and nine main sections can contain a small airstream with panoramic views throughout the skyscraper, you can functionally get an amazing view on each floor. Gensler, an American architectural firm, designed this building originally aimed to function as hotels and offices, but more features were added to accommodate more. Number 1. Burj Khalifa, Dubai. Height 828 meters, 163 floors. The Burj Khalifa, known as the Burj Dubai prior to its inauguration in 2010, is a skyscraper in Dubai, United Arab Emirates, with a total height of 829.8 meters and a roof height excluding antenna but including a 244 meter spire of 828 meters. The Burj Khalifa has been the tallest structure whose construction began in 2004 with the exterior completed five years later in 2009. The building was opened in 2010 as part of a new development called Downtown Dubai. It is designed to be the centerpiece of large-scale mixed-use development and the decision to construct the building is based on the government's decision to diversify from oil-based economy and for Dubai to gain international recognition. The building was originally named Burj Dubai but was renamed in honor of the ruler of Abu Dhabi and president of the United Arab Emirates, Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan. The building broke numerous heights records, including its designation as the tallest building in the world. Its architectures intended the design, primarily from steel and concrete by the same engineers in charge of other famous super talls, such as the Willis Tower in Chicago and One World Trade Center in New York City. Burj Khalifa has 19 residential towers with 30,000 residences, 9 restaurants, shopping malls, and an artificial lake. Burj Khalifa has 163 floors, making it the highest floor building in the world. There you have it, the explorers. Those were the top 10 tallest buildings in the world. Thanks for watching this video. If you want us to cover any of your top 10 topics, leave a suggestion in the comments and we will do well to grant your request. Also, if you did enjoy this video, do well to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe and share with your friends.